welcome back to the weekly vlog i'm jasmine if you're new here don't forget to like comment and subscribe down below today's monday february 13th so it's my valentine's day happy valentine's day to you finally made it to the car i've been literally procrastinating leaving the house for about an hour but yeah we're gonna go to target i want to get some things for um, little Valentine's Day baskets for my kids and also something for Johnny. So I'm trying to decide what I want to do for tomorrow in terms of dessert because I'm doing my little day night like I told you guys last week. So I'm trying to decide if I wanted to get cupcakes from Sprinkles Bakery. Um, if I wanted to do crumble cookies. I'm giving my road lip peptide a, a break because I've been... <laughs> i've been really going hard for it so i'm using my summer fridays today i love these as well this one here is the i think this shade is called hot chocolate no what's this called brown sugar just made made up a name <laughs> hot chocolate it's called brown sugar as i was saying i'm trying to decide what we're gonna have for dessert johnny loves cookies um crumble cookies is in the city and it's gonna be really packed i am assuming because smart valentine's day so i really don't know if it's a good idea to even attempt that i'm gonna go to the mall i need to go to target i'm gonna grab coffee and i just had some leftover super bowl snacks <laughs> for brunch because it's like 12 o'clock right now i think mm, it's 12 30 so yeah we're gonna go get coffee we're gonna scroll through target and i probably I want to go to Claire's to get something for Callie. Just like a little thing I want to put in her basket. That's all I can think of. I just pulled into the mall. We're going to go to Claire's first and get that out the way. Because Claire's is in the mall, in the mall. So I just want to get that out the way. And then I'm going to go to Target and probably spend most of my time there. <laughs> per usual. So, yeah. Um, I'm gonna take the mic off so I don't look as awkward. All right, so let's go. Let me put All right, y'all. I'm back from the mall. I went to Target and then I went to. I actually went to Claire's and I went to another store. It's like a little. I think like maybe Japanese. It has like little, um, it's called Miniso. But it has like little cute little things. So I got a couple things in there for Cali. And then I got some stuff at Target. And I got a pistachio cold brew. All of a sudden, it's like really hot outside. I'm about to take my coat off. It's so hot. I put the windows down. But yeah, we're going to go to Party City. I wanted to get um, tablecloth and then um, I think that's pretty much it, just tablecloth, maybe like some balloons or whatever for tomorrow, but yeah, let's go to Party City and hopefully <laughs> they still have some stuff for Valentine's Day. If not, I'll make something out of what I have at home, but pray for me. <laughs> I need to figure out if I should use, should I use this exit or the other exit? I don't know. Um... We had a little Super Bowl party last night. Anyways, I had so much salt because I had pizza, I had wings. I feel so bloated today um, from all that sodium. So I need to drink some water, to be honest. <laughs> I need to drink some more water. I'm over here drinking coffee. That's the last thing I need right now. Wait, which way am I going? I feel like I'm going the wrong way. I'm so confused. There are a lot of people at the mall today. All right, I went the right way. For whatever reason. goodness i totally forgot to even talk about the big news at the super bowl i mean baby shower <laughs> during the halftime show johnny and i are watching like we sent the kids away because we weren't sure like what she was gonna do certain things you know like i 
prefer the kids not watch so I wasn't sure like what she was gonna come out doing looking like wearing whatever the case so she comes out and I'm like oh wait a minute is is she and let me tell you something I am the last person to ever question mention talk about somebody being pregnant just off of looking at them like I do not do that at all give it to myself even if I'm thinking it and honestly a lot of the times I'm not even noticing because I'm not somebody who stares people down and notices every little thing about them to be honest like I'm really not like half the time somebody else will be coming to me and saying is so and so pregnant and I'm like what very observant with people's character like how they move but when it comes to like appearance and like what you got going on I tend to overlook that stuff so so Miss Rihanna comes on and immediately I'm like wait I haven't seen her in a while I haven't seen her in a while but I feel like the last time I saw her she had lost a lot of the baby weight but I still wasn't sure so I'm watching I'm watching and then she does this like fake baby rub like belly rub and I'm like wait a minute wait is she did she just rub her belly? But she didn't do it like fully, you know, like she tried to play us. All of a sudden she turns to the side and you get that side view of her profile. And in that side view, it was like, oh, I think she's, it just looked intentional. It wasn't even because it looks like she was pregnant, which it did. It was, it looked like it was very intentional. Like she wanted us to think that she was. Johnny and I are going back and forth because he's not, he's like, forget how she looks. Like she's not even moving like she's not really dancing she's like going like this and then she's like sitting down and i'm like yeah you're right you're right anyways i'm gonna go to pretty city and hopefully get some stuff um a couple things okay so i'm back home from target i wanted to show you guys what i picked up i got this little heart box for johnny's i actually wanted a couple more of these but i only found one so that's all I could find. Um, then I went to Home Goods and I got the. Actually, I went to Party City first. So I got some candles, the little tea light candles. And then I also got this table um, cover from Party City. I'm going to put the table runner over that. And then I also got these at Home Goods because I wanted to get something to put the tea lights in. And I thought these would be really cute. So I'm going to take the cover off, of course, and then just have the tea lights in here. I'm drinking a sparkling water. This one is lemon from Whole Foods. Okay, this is what it looks like. This is really nice. I love these. Uh, honestly, they don't even need a container. I feel like they look good on their own. So this is what it looks like with in the jar. Honestly, I feel like they look good on their own. I don't think I need the jars. I feel like they look better without the jars. The jars are cute, but I don't think they're necessary. So I'll probably use them for something else. Happy Valentine's Day, y'all. Happy Valentine's Day. It is Tuesday, February 14th, Valentine's Day. I just got to the gym. I'm going to do a little workout probably just cardio and um st strength training so i left the gym i just pulled into starbucks to grab some breakfast i got a croissant, croissant. and i also got a ooh, that's yesterday's drink i got a matcha um i got ice matcha with oat milk because i had celsius um well i had a lani new so that has a ton of caffeine. I didn't want to get any more caffeine. Well, I didn't want to get coffee because I figure it has more caffeine than this. So I'm going to drink this and drive home. I need to shower, film, and then edit. I need to shower, film, edit really quickly and then start getting ready for our date night, which I'm so excited for. Like I said, last week's vlog, I've been meaning to do this for a while. So I'm excited to finally do it. Oh, this came out so good. Mmm. Who make this? It's so good. 
sometimes they just don't make the matcha right and then other times they make it so good hey girl it's 1 56 i just got done well i finished filming maybe 30 minutes ago i've been doing some tiktoks i did like three or four like funny tiktoks the video that i filmed is going to be a tiktok as well so technically i did like five i guess um but i'm really excited i'm gonna go edit i did it in 4k so i'm super nervous about it like i was saying earlier but as far as the contour sticks go i really like them in my last vlog i showed you guys the color that i thought i was gonna use but i changed my mind i think the deepest shade is perfect because you can kind of get your desired look with using either less or more of it if you're around my skin tone so the shade is called sizzle the deepest one that's the one i think will be like the best one the best option for like fenty 420 around that skin tone but anyways anyways i'm gonna go edit real quick speed edit session because i really need to get our little date night organized and i also need to tell johnny what to order because he's gonna order our food we're doing cheesecake factory for food I have a light over here because i was trying to film my tiktoks in this corner but then i changed my mind and i sat back at my desk but um yeah let's go edit this video you know so i'm gonna start setting up i actually brought the tv here last night this tv was in this tv was in our like sunroom that we use in the summertime so i brought it in here so that way we could have a big screen because the one we have in here right now is like 32 inches this is like a 60 a 55 or 60 inch i forget which one it is but it's a lot bigger we'll have johnny do that because johnny's usually really good at picking up movies i'm not really a movie person like he's more of the movie person than i am i think prior to meeting johnny i probably only seen like i don't know 10 movies <laughs> in my lifetime i really was not a big movie person like i'd watch like maybe three movies a year i don't know like i i was just not into movies i was like into a lot of other things like scrapbook and reading and stuff like that so yeah johnny definitely put me on to movies but i've known johnny since i was 19 so um so i've definitely uh, so i've definitely caught up over the years speaking of i don't know if i ever told you guys this story so basically valentine's day um 12 years ago johnny and i had a class together it was anthropology and he wrote me a letter he wrote me a well did he? No, he typed me up a letter. He typed me a letter, put it in an envelope, and brought it to class. And then he gave it to me after class, asking me to be his Valentine's Day. It was a long letter, but at the end, that's what it asked me. So, yeah, that's how it all started. Anyways, I'm going to put this on. And then he also made me a breakfast in bed. Use it. Like, we lived on campus, y'all. So, he used the little Yankee kitchen that they had downstairs like we didn't have we lived in the dorms like we didn't have like our own like campus apartment or whatever so he used the dorm kitchen and if you are familiar like a lot of these dorm kitchens are not like the best but he used like a plastic fork and then he said like the fork broke so like it was like melting <laughs> so he had like half of a fork it was just so cute all right so i'm using the little x and o's and I'm going to put them on my dresser. I'm going to show you guys what I'm doing. Oh my gosh. I'm in 4K, girl. It says it's going to take a whole hour to get half of these files onto my hard drive. I have a whole other memory card. Because the first memory card that I used, it, it ran out of space. So I don't know if we're going to be doing any more 4K um, videos that are long. So anyways, I'm going to put out. Ow cut myself i also have these lights which i'm gonna put in this jar this is an old candle jar and i'm gonna turn them on i'm gonna do this later though but i'm gonna show you guys what it looks like so like i also have this love sign that i'm gonna put like this because i have this love sign here okay so the tablecloth has some crease in so i'm gonna try to iron them out i hope this works <laughs> I'm gonna put the runner. Also, I'm getting the table together. I have to figure out the candle situation, but the table is coming along. So 
so cute. All right, so I put the little hearts in there. Over here, I'm gonna add the chocolate covered strawberries onto this platter. I counted 18 strawberries. The sun is setting, so I wanted to show you guys really quickly before it sets what the candles look like. I also pulled out my pajamas I'm gonna wear. These, I got these from Show Me Your Moo. I thought they were so cute for Valentine's Day, so I'm gonna be wearing these. This is my OOTD. I did put the lights in the little jar. And I also put out the strawberries, the chocolate covered strawberries. So, yeah, I'm gonna light the candle. Gonna select a nice movie. It's gonna be a vibe. Okay, I need to get up. It's like seven, I need to get up at 7.25 to make the kids lunches. I'm so tired. <laughs> Hey y'all, it is several hours later. Came back from the gym and I'm just in these comfy clothes because I wanted to be comfy today. I'm gonna go get some groceries. I'm actually gonna go to Trader Joe's today. I haven't been there in a while because I've been doing a lot of pickup. I've been doing like a lot of ordering online, picking up delivery um, grocery orders. I, oh my gosh, Johnny got me the most amazing smelling Bath and Body Works set i'll show you guys when i get back home hopefully i remember but it smells really good honestly when i first saw it i was like "Ooh, i hope i like this and then i opened it it smelled so good all right so i just got my croissant and my drink i got a tall because it's later in the day and i don't want to be up all night I head to Sephora now. It's kind of dangerous because I'm going to Sephora without a plan. I like to go to Sephora and know exactly what I'm getting in there because it's a trap. Um, yeah. There are a few things that I know I wanted to try. Um, so I'm just going to go take a quick little browse. See what's good in there. Although I literally was there like <laughs> a couple days ago. So I'm back home from Trader Joe's. I just had to pick up a few things that we needed. So I got some meatballs. These are for Cali. Honestly, most of this is for the kids. So got some meatballs for Cali, some fries and turkey burgers. These are for Clay. Also got some ground turkey for tacos for the kids. Some plants and chips for Cali. The burger buns. I got this. This was new, so I wanted this was new, so I wanted to try it out. This is an olive and basil pesto. We have salmon in the fridge, so I think I'm gonna try this with the salmon. Also got some blueberries for Cali, some Japanese yams, because we actually have some curry chicken that I need to use. So I wanna try making it with this. And then I got some jasmine rice because we were out of rice. This is the first time I actually went to Trader Joe's and didn't get a treat. I was so tempted, you guys, but between the cheesecake I had yesterday and my birthday's coming up, I decided that I didn't need any more treats. Went to Sephora and I picked up a couple things. Some of what I wanted was not in stock, but I did get this Amika 
um, conditioner. So one of you guys told me to get this one. So I'm going to try this one. And then I picked up the Makeup by Mario in my correct shade. Because I have this. I have this but not in my correct shade. So I got um, 230. I need to put everything in. Hey y'all, it's Thursday. I just got done filming. I did my first impression of the new Makeup Forever HD Skin Matte Velvet Powder. Last year was all about the glow. This year is matte AF. Well, let's hope my camera does not fall from this fake tripod I just created. I have a PR package I want to open it with you guys. Ooh, it's a little yellow box. So cute. And they sent over the Flip the Switch on Dark Spots. It is a night cream, I believe. So it's a serum that's targeting dark spots, which I'm excited for because... Oh, wait, it's not just a serum. It's a serum, a moisturizer, and um, some other like product. They're all targeting dark spots, which I definitely want to try. I do deal with dark spots from having acne like whenever i break out whenever i break out if i pick at my face anything like that i get dark spots so easily it's so annoying like i bruise very easily i see stuff like this i'm always down to try so this is the serum brighten and concentrate ooh, ooh. <laughs> okay then we have the cream this is the moisturizer this one is for brightness, evenness, and hydration. It has a complex of meadow sweet from Provence and also has white mul white mulberry, vitamin C, and licorice extract. So what's in the cream? I want to see the packaging because it looks really pretty in the picture. Ooh, this is so cute. <laughs> Look at the packaging. I'm always looking for products that promise dark spot reduction. That is one of my most annoying skincare concerns. Um, yeah. So we're gonna go get Cali. Um, the foundation powder is looking real good, y'all. Not gonna lie. This shade looks really good, but I do feel like the 67, 4N67, I think it is, would be the better match for me. So I'll let you guys know for sure. When the foundation launches, I'm gonna go to Sephora and test it out to see. But right now, I'm really liking it. So I'm about to start cleaning my desk because it's looking crazy. Like there's so much stuff <laughs> from filming today. So yeah, we need to clean. Um, I'm going to start putting stuff away. This is the new Makeup Forever powder that I tried today. And the old one. I have been seeing online that they are replacing this one with this one. So that's what I think is happening with these. I forgot I was cooking. Let me go get the chicken. Straight out the oven so it's hot, but I made some curry chicken. Friday, it's also my birthday. <laughs> um, so I just dropped Callie off at school. I'm actually gonna order some coffee right now. I'm gonna get my little Starbucks birthday drink. The salted caramel cream cold brew because I never had it. I'm gonna do a venti because it's my birthday. <laughs> All right, I got my drink and my pastry. Well, breakfast, I guess. Got the bacon gouda with no egg. Hopefully, they did it right. Okay, they did do it right. Last time I got this, they did no bacon, but they left the egg in there. So, they got it right. And I got a huge venti um, salted caramel cold brew. So... I've been drinking cold brew lately. I don't think it has as much caffeine as like a, as a, uh, as a espresso drink. So I've been drinking that lately. All right, so I'm heading home. I'm just gonna do my brows again <laughs> real quick because I accidentally put foundation over them. Okay, using the Refi pencil my outfit of the day i'm wearing my good american jeans and this um 
crew neck from Skims. Nice pink color. I'm also wearing my bum bag. I'm going to brunch right now with my parents because they're the only ones that are home. So they're taking me out to brunch. Um, so yeah, we're gonna do that right now. We're gonna go to First Watch Cafe. I really like First Watch. So we're gonna go there. I'm wearing my Louis Vuitton hoops today. And I haven't worn these in a while. So I wanted to put these on. I thought they were cute for my birthday. But yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna go out to brunch. I'm back home and tell me why I was checking my camera to see the footage that I recorded earlier because I like to do that nowadays just to make sure I get what I recorded and I was recorded in slow motion so I can't use the footage did a little bit of planning for the next two weeks of February um but overall I've just been relaxing and not like I can do much work anyway because Johnny accidentally took my laptop to work with him <laughs> yes it was a blessing in disguise because i would have definitely been doing a lot of work if he hadn't i did want to think about some goals for my 32nd year of life um i like to kind of reflect see where i am and just see where i want to go and you know ultimately god's in charge so whatever you plan is never guaranteed but just kind of giving myself a little bit of a um like a guide like I have my vision board I know what I want for this year but just you know reflecting and just thinking of life and stuff like that I mean myself up until 31 because 31 in my mind was when I was gonna have kids and get married and all that stuff when I was younger like a teenager um 31 was the age where oh my gosh I'm gonna get married at 31 I'm gonna have kids at 31 I never thought about 32 you know <laughs> obviously I had my kids way earlier than 31 but being that it was kind of like how I saw my life for so long since I was a child up until I actually had a kid at 20. Um, I was just kind of like, I feel like it's just, I feel like I never saw what was after that, you know? Hopefully what I'm saying makes sense. But I'm going to talk to you guys a little bit later. Yeah. All right, I'm going to go get Callie now. I think it's time to get her. I am so excited right now. Johnny got me a freaking new iPad because my other one broke. This one broke. It has a big dent. Um, he got me an iPad for my birthday. I'm like so excited. And he said it's the pink one. It looks like it's pink right here. He said it's the pink one. I'm so excited. I cannot wait to open this. He got me this candle. This is beige. And he said he smelled them all and he felt like this one smelled the best. So thankful he got this one because this is actually the only one that I like from Dipte. It smells so good. I'm like so excited to have this out. It smells so good. Oh my gosh, y'all. I'm so excited. And then he also got me some candy. I'll show you guys. I love this brand. He got me some bubbly. He says it's like champagne. Here. I want a little a Starbucks gift card. And so excited. Yeah, I was definitely not expecting the iPad, but I'm so excited because I've been missing having one and I cannot wait to unbox this. I'm about to have some Stella Rosa. This is not ideal, but I can't find my wine glass. I think it's in the dishwasher. Cheers to you guys. We're clearly back from P.F. Chang's. I didn't really vlog there. I just kind of was like in the moment, I guess. But yeah, I just 
set up my iPad. I'm so excited. It's like a baby pink color, which I didn't even know they had this color, but it's like a it's like a nice like a nice like baby pink which it kind of looks silver on camera but it's pink and to get the paper that goes on the screen like the screen protector cover uh, so I need to find an iPad case so I'm looking for that right now as well oh I may or may not be silver so um <laughs> I'm from, I can't tell I'm gonna have a lot of editing to do in this part of the vlog but it's okay Oh my gosh, this color is so pretty. Okay, so they have this color. Watermelon pink color. Good morning. It is Saturday morning. Um, let's go. We're about to take Callie to basketball practice right now. It's like 8.45 in the morning, so it's pretty early. But it's a beautiful day. Ooh, somebody just parked next to me. Let me bring the camera down. <laughs> I don't know why that's always so awkward. Like, I can't even look now. I have my coffee. I'm using my little Starbucks tumbler. Johnny got me coffee um, earlier, but they put so much coffee in the other cup, it was making a mess. So I poured it into this. But yeah, we're gonna go to her game. I just got home. I decided to change my phone case because I just wanted to switch it up a little bit, I guess, for my new age, <laughs> the new year. So. I'm going to take off my old case. I put the um, string in this little hole, but on this side, and then I looped it into here. I use a little earring back. I actually, I use the back of an earring to stick it in because it was hard to fit it into this hole. This is my new phone and, well, this is my new phone case. I feel like I just got a little upgrade. I'm currently working on a to-do list for my iPad. So I wanted to create a little to-do list. That way I can use it like a PDF, basically. So it's taken me so long because I'm using PicMonkey. And it's kind of like Canva. It's like Canva's better, but I'm so used to PicMonkey that I basically just still use it. That's how much I've eaten, y'all. Like, this is so bad. But I... <laughs> this is so good. It's the caramel the dark chocolate sea salt they're both really good by the way i love caramel and dark chocolate together oh my gosh so good and then i also love gummy stuff and this is like champagne so so good one of the things i wanted to learn was procreate so i'm giving myself a little crash course right now i'm currently editing my vlog and i realized that i didn't tell you guys uh, my mom wants gum um I didn't tell you guys some of the stuff I was working on, so I figured I'll do that right now. For the Procreate stuff, I basically was playing around with it. Created this little grocery list thing for groceries. I also did my thumbnail in there. So this is the thumbnail for this vlog that you're watching. So basically I wrote this stuff. I drew the little hearts, put the text on there. I've been wanting to learn this for a few months, but I didn't have an iPad, so I couldn't really play around with it. This is the daily planner I mentioned I was working on on Saturday as well. So I put it in the Good Notes app. So basically, this is, um, you know, my daily planner for now. I have my to-do list section, the top three are priorities, and then I have my gratitude section, self-care section, meal section, so I could put like what I'm going to eat, like a hydration habit tracker and then also a section for brain dump this is what i put for today so far edit weekly vlog workout eat healthy and this is my calorie goal and then i have a few things that i had written for my meals so yeah this is kind of like how i want to use it anyways i'm going to finish editing this and i will talk to you guys in my next vlog <laughs>